at the uh, down here at the uh, near the beach here at one like a little park here. I've got the new hay boxing uh, car here. We have already done the uh, you know the unboxing and everything. This is the 112 scale. Uh, we're gonna give it a test run down here, see how it does today. Back here, and I have the um, the hay boxing 112 scale uh, 903. RC monster truck right here. Uh, we've done the unboxing already, um, and I'm filming this after the unboxing, even though you're probably gonna see this first. And I'm gonna go over a lot of the details in, in the unboxing portion of the video, but just wanna give you a little bit of overview here. Um, this was, first of all, um, I did not purchase this car myself. The good folks over at Hay Boxing sent it to me. So uh, just get that right up front here. But this is not a sponsored review. They're not paying me to do the review. You know, I'm not getting any money in any way. I just got the product. So um, uh, let's get some things straight right off the bat here. Uh, you can purchase this on Amazon.com. Uh, the price is uh, 109 but uh, I will uh, set you up with a link to get you, uh, you know, like a coupon code to get a discount on this so you can, you know, get it for less than this. I do not know right this minute how much that the final price would be, but I will save you some money on this day if you click the link in the uh, the video. I'll put it at the very top of the description. Be the, the link will be the very first thing you see when you scroll down to the description. So uh, again, 109 normal price on uh, Amazon. If you're a Prime member, you get the free shipping on it, of course, and it, and it, and it ships out almost immediately. Like if, uh, you know, uh, this is a Saturday, the, the 22nd of October. If I ordered it right now, it'd be here in two days on Monday. So shipping immediately, you know, from, uh, from the Amazon warehouse. So, okay. Uh, this is, you know, the latest model from, from Hay Boxing. Uh, the new models usually come out this time of year and time for the holidays. If you got any, you know, our big RC fans on your holiday list, you know, uh, here's an opportunity to go ahead and get this thing early here. Um, I've reviewed many cars for uh, Hay Boxing over the last couple of years, and this is the best one I've uh, I've had my hands on yet. I've only you know, uh, ran it, uh, you know, two or three times. So I still need to get more experience with it. I will put a, uh, some clips later on of me, you know, running it uh, on some asphalt uh, down near the beach, kind of a as top a little bit of sand on so I'm getting a little drifting or whatever. But um, I, I you know, just in my limited testing, I really like this thing uh, so far. And again, you'll see a little bit of in this video, and I plan on making a series, a series of videos on this. So this is just the very first video. We'll take a deeper dive into later uh, videos coming in the series. But um, you know, just a, a couple things right off the top. It, it is four wheel drive. I'm, I'm, I'm reading off a, you know, uh, some notes here I wrote down. Uh, it is four wheel drive. I, I already said it's one twelve scale. Um, it's, uh, it, it says it's ready to run with 40 minutes uh, of play time. And what that means is you get two batteries with it. These are um, 15 milliamp batteries, 7.4. So you get two of them. Each one will get you 20 minutes of run time. And they're powerful batteries too. Like I really, you know, felt the power yesterday when I was uh, hitting the throttle on, on these. So, uh, you know, these batteries have a lot of oomph to them uh, to get you, get you going. One's in the truck. And, and one's, uh, you know, uh, comes along. And the, and the um, unboxing, I'll show you, they send, they send the standard USB charger. So, um, yeah, one of the things that really stands out in this thing so far is, uh, I know every time I do an RC car review, I always get the first, one of the first questions, does it have oil-filled shocks? And uh, so that's a much demanded, uh, we'll say, feature that's requested in these RC cars. And until now, it's usually been reserved for more expensive cars or it's been an upgrade feature. You buy a car like this and then you buy oil shocks and you replace them yourself. But this comes with um, front and rear oil filled shocks. So, um, you know, and believe me, they are really nice. I mean, uh, I, I, you know, even though I, I, you know, went full throttle, uh, during my test runs, I never flipped it or whatever. It really, you know, these shocks were just hugged the ground like you wouldn't, wouldn't believe and just, you know, really smooth ride. I wanted, can't wait to get a, my GoPro on top of that and uh, see how smooth it is and, and see, if, if, you know, even then I may, you know, I mean, you know, because they're a real easy tip when you put the GoPro on top of We'll see how that goes. So that is a, um, you know, a really, you know, important feature for many people. So um, kudos to Hey, boxing. Okay. Also, it has uh, metal drive shafts front and rear. Um, you know, so that's another thing. Everybody's, you know, um, 
you know, been requesting over the years. That's one one, one of the questions I get all the time. And uh, let's see here, my getting my. It's got hobby grade steering, and it has ball bearings. Another feature that people have been, you know, requesting. I, I'm gonna. I already showed the the metal uh, gears in the uh, unboxing, so I won't. I won't do it again here. So um, I just want to cover some of the some of the other things I did not mention in the, um, you know, uh, in the unboxing. So yeah, it's um, you know. It's really, you know, it's uh, the, you know, whether you like the colors or whatever, that's your personal opinion. I don't know if you can get more shells for it or not. I'll, you know, kind of, uh, well, here they, uh, they don't show another shell in the box. Well, they, yeah, they don't show another shell in the box. But I'm sure I'll talk to my contact over at uh, Start RC and see if other shells are, are, are available. But, um, yeah, so that's my, my early impressions are, you know, again, it's the best product I've ever you know, receive from them uh, as far as, uh, you know, the way it runs. I mean, here is, uh, I, I think I showed this partly in the video. I think I had a sticker on it. So, you know, kind of the standard, um, you know, 2.4 uh, gigahertz uh, controller here. But it seemed to have plenty of range. Uh, you know, I, I will try to test the range at some point. But uh, in, in this little video, I do not have it. But again, series of uh, videos on this car is coming because I'm very excited about it. And, uh, you know, if you have anybody on your... Um, holiday shopping list that uh, wants an RC car and uh, they but you know you don't you can't break the bank and this is going to be the right price especially with the discount code I'm throwing in and uh, and 112 scale has always seemed to be the sweet spot the smaller ones like the 116 the 118 scale they're great but um, they're great for asphalt and cement and hard surfaces but once you get them in some grass or whatever they're they're a little bit small but this one as you can see you know, has the 112 scale has pretty good ground clearance there, you know, so you can really kind of get this, um, you in some high grass or, you know, um, even anything like that, some, some weeds or whatever, some off-road surfaces and will not get, you know, caught in, on the bottom. So, um, you know, uh, again, I really think, again, repeat myself, this is a sweet spot for the size. So then you get the bigger ones, the one eighth scales and things like that. And they're, you know, really huge uh, to take around and carry around and so on. So, yeah, uh, so I really like the size on this. And, of course, it has that they call it splash-proof electronics. Uh, you would not want to submerge this, but, you know, of course, you could ride through puddles and shallow water and things like that and maybe, you know, in some, in some light rain. So, uh, you know, it's it's very versatile. Again, a lot of stuff packed into a $109 car that, again, going to get you at a, at a discount. So, okay, so sit back here and watch the... Um, the unboxing, you know, I, I don't make it one of these monster 20 minute unboxing, you know, it's, it, I'm in and out on the unboxing and show you everything, but I, I, and I try to go over some of the features that I missed here, but I don't linger. And then we'll have a little bit of a road test uh, where you see it uh, before I'm out in the field. It, it, again, I, I just ran it a couple times. Uh, I, I need to get out and experience more, but again, there's more videos coming. If you have any questions, please ask them down below in the comments. And if I can't answer them, uh, uh, you know, I'll get my contact at uh, Hey Boxing to answer them for you. So uh, again, you know, links will be down below. Uh, it'll be the, the said that discount code and the purchase link will be right at the top of whatever, so you can go in and get it right away. And uh, uh, that's about it for this portion. Enjoy the rest of the video, and you know, we'll see you back on uh, the next uh, video in this series on the Hey Boxing uh, 903. Enjoy. All right, it's that time of year again. Uh, Hey, Boxing is releasing their new models uh, just in time for the holiday uh, gift buying season. So if you have anybody on your list is looking to get an RC truck, um, I'm going to show you uh, the latest from Hey, Boxing. Uh, I do have a uh, coupon code for this also that I will include in the links down below so you can save money already even though this thing's brand new. I don't think there's, you know, many reviews up on this yet. Um, this is the... Uh, the Hay Boxing uh, Vanguard uh, 112 scale four wheel drive off road race truck, item number 903. So it has this, you know, uh, drawing, you know, almost like a, um, what do you call it, a um, thermal image of the uh, truck. It's a uh, full, full 112 full scale truck down here, branding. Um, you can see the, the pictures of various, uh, the, the, truck in various modes of um, travel there. Uh, here's some of the specs on the side here. We'll read some of them off to you here. Um, this uh, this truck has, uh, it's ready to run, 
four wheel drive, 2.4 gigahertz uh, transmission from the remote to the truck. It has a qualified shocks, adjustable ring, ball bearings, um, uh, brush power, uh, brushless uh, optional motors, uh, optional metal spur, uh, differential gears, and splash um, waterproof electronics. Uh, not suitable for users under 14 unless closely supervised by adults. Uh, let's see here. Here we have some more information over here. Um, Vanguard recognizes the 112 scale 4x4 race truck comes in ready to run out of the box. Fast acceleration with a Type 390 motor. Responsive proportional throttle steering control. Independent suspension and high ground clearance help to make the all-terrain vehicle out of it. Um, delicate uh, configuration fulfills a streamlined and natty chassis layout. Uh, we should have a great run. Another full full size picture of the truck, and then underneath just the usual uh, technical stuff on the back there. General safety, overall precautions. Um, here's some of the warnings here. So uh, let's get right down to the unboxing. I've cut everything loose here, so let's see how we get this out of here. Okay, here's some stuff falling right out of the box here. So here is your uh, op operation manual. Here is uh, some literature about hay, hay boxes, other products, kind of a catalog of different vehicles. Uh, here is some uh, stickers for your car. And uh, here is your warranty card. So let's see here. What's, here I like these on this package. I did an unboxing the day where it has this nice kind of pull tab here to pull everything out. So there we go. There's everything out of the box. Put the box to the side here. Now, uh, I've done this before with the hay boxing products. Um, yeah, you see they're well packed here. They have a, a kind of a three-tier um, system here for, uh, you know, really great um, way to transport them. So you pull these two off. There is the truck. Okay, there it is, all four sides. And uh, just to put to the side for a second, here is the rest of the gear here. Um, here's the uh, remote down here, trying to figure out the best way to get this out of here. This this pulls up here, pulls down there. And uh, we're just gonna pop this up a little bit to get the uh, control wheel underneath the cardboard here. Pull our controller out. Here is our extras here. Okay. Take a good look at the controller here. Has a warning sticker here. Did not move the trigger before binding. It's fulfilled. Um, standard buttons up top. Um, steering trim, speed switch, uh, steering reverse on and off. Here is your, you know, your steering here. Here's your throttle. Here's always the extra button in here. We'll have to figure that out. Batteries go in the bottom here. Uh, you need um, two double A's. And uh, here's what we get in the, um, this, this thing here to take a, like a lug, lug nut thing to get your wheels on and off. In this kit here, you got your extra battery, uh, your USB charging uh, cable there, some extra uh, cotter pins and your extra battery. The other battery's inside here, which we will get to here. Um, here's the look of the car here from all the way around. Take the pins off. Here's the car, here's the underneath the car, here's your other battery there. Uh, here's your connectors here. So, um, your shocks, it has, has lights to it there, to the front. So, um, yeah, it looks really nice. Um, 
that's the quick unboxing here. We're gonna, you know, um, get it out to the field here, give it a test run as soon as we get the batteries charged up. And um, yeah, we'll see you back in the next portion of the video.